first I'll demonstrate the improvement done for code editor. As we all know, uh, there is a stripping uh, trialing white spaces in C, C++ editor. Here, uh, I think user uh, might have used it already. So it, it comes under here in editor and then save options. Here we have set of uh, preferences which works only for generated code, not for the model code before generation. So initially we thought of uh, using this preference, but later we came to know that this is uh, internal and uh, we cannot access it. Okay, so because of that reason, what we have made is we have introduced our own preference, which, uh, which is similar to that under real time development code editing preference tab. Okay, so here we have a new checkbox uh, introduced called remove trailing white spaces automatically. If this is enabled, what happens is, see if you see here, we have a, a nice documentation. It talks like how basically this will uh, remove the white spaces in code editor as well as in the code view. Okay, so before enabling this, I'll go back and uh, try to uh, modify some code without enabling that how does uh, this works. So here I have a get active uh, light transition. So what I do, I will add some comment here. This is uh, get active light transition and I will add some spaces as well as tabs. Of course, I'll introduce some uh, unnecessary white spaces here. Okay. So now uh, we have a white space here. We can see white spaces are present here now and save. But if I enable this preference, Now, if I make any modification now and save it, now we see uh, white spaces are not there. Okay. And this can also be uh, tried on the code editor. So I will launch source code editor for this for effect. Okay. So now uh, here and uh, here also. I'll just turn off this reference and as well, I will enable white spaces. Okay. So here uh, we can enable uh, um, where is that? Okay, I didn't find this fine, no problem. Uh, but uh, intention was to show the white space characters here. So now I'm adding some spaces here, some tabs. Now I'm saving. So the preference was actually enabled. That is fine. So I'll go back to real time development and disable that. Okay, so now if I add spaces, basically they should get saved as there. You can see cursor is uh, blinking here. Now if I enable it back again, okay. So this time it got removed the trailing voice spaces. Yeah, that's all about uh, this uh, usability improvement. So user can enable this and uh, try to get rid of unnecessary spaces.